Workload is up 205% in the last quarter. We just don't have the manpower to cover these numbers. We need one of these candidates to work. Well, I don't want him to be too good. Well, I don't want him to be too bad. All right, settled then. More bad than good. But I didn't say that. Who are the candidates? Well, the first guy looks ideal. He volunteers regularly. He was head of his class. Hey, wait a sec. What's that? What? Nothing. No, right there. He was a cheerleader. Michael, I was a cheerleader. Exactly. Hey, who's the other guy? He's impressive too. Hardworking. Not too ambitious. I like that. No, he sounds perfect. I'll have Chuck bring him in. I think that was a little excessive. Oh, I think your order's a little excessive. Hey, boss. <laughs> the busing? That was me! <laughs> what, what? How? Yeah! All right, keeping it real! That energy could go a long way in my department. So you're an equal opportunity employer? <laughs> I'm calling you a retard. Now I know what you're thinking. What is this place? That's the negative. But this is the positive division of Karma Inc. Here. I'm sure you've heard the saying, no good deed goes unnoticed, right? Yeah. Who do you think notices? I don't know, God? <laughs> no, he's way too busy. Who notices, guys? We do! A super job team. Basically, every good deed that happens on Earth gets processed through our division and positively reflects on that individual's karma score. Once that score reaches a certain level, we ensure good things happen in return. I'll show you around. I, mean, I, I don't get it. I mean, if, if that was the case, then why was I killed? I mean, I, I think I live a pretty positive and, you know, honest lifestyle. Yeah, I think that's an HR question. So anyway, here we go. This is Hank. Okay, Hank. Okay, Hank, we've talked about this. Uh, uh, what? Sorry, I, I, uh, sorry, what? Uh, about watching adult material in the workplace? Me? No, I, I, I would not dream of that. All right, not since you and I had that great talk. I would never. Oh. 
you know what? I, I think it's Mabel. I heard that. Don't pin your porno problems on me, Hank. What? No, I was saying... Uh, you know, wow. Actually, it, it actually is coming from my computer. Huh? Can you believe that? <laughs> what? Uh, it must be an IT problem. Hank, I had Bobby from IT look into your profile. Bobby. See this calculator? It's scientific. Bobby. <laughs> well, this was not easy. I had to go in through the back end, through multiple databases, on my own time. Bobby, we're 24 hours a day here. It's all company time. On my own time, Bobby. In the past 48 hours? Hank has somehow managed to spend 49 hours surfing pornography. What? What? How is that even possible? I, no, I don't want to know. Hank, I'm sorry, but you're going to have to move yourself to the negative division. This is not the behavior of someone on our team. Pack up your things. No, just this way. Sorry I had to see all that. Oh, Joyce isn't here. Okay, so you're gonna wanna watch out for Yvette. Because, oh, because she's a super lady. Hi. Hi. Oh, he flirts. Uh, <laughs> he's not management. Did you get my memo? No, I can't say I did. Oh, you. Oh. <laughs> Yvette. 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 Uh, Yvette, I'm just doing a tour of the office right now, okay? Yvette. Uh, oh, Yvette. Oh, 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 oh. Okay, so just wait a minute. What does that mean by 24 hours a day? Well, we work 24 hours a day. Seven days a week. We're always open. You mean the office, right? So would I choose my own shifts? Yeah, oh yeah, you can start at 7 a.m. and go until 6.55 a.m. Or if you're not an early riser, we're totally flexible with that. You can start at 10 a.m. and go until 9.55 a.m. We like to give you five minutes for what we call you time. Where do I spend my five minutes? At your desk. Remember, 24 hours a day, seven days a week. We're always open. But 23 hours and 55 minutes a day, that's a long time to work. Well, I mean, it's hardly work. We all enjoy being here so much. In fact, Joyce is the head of our office fun crew. Hawaiian hey. shirt stay is going over like gangbusters. <laughs> all right. <laughs> hey, so what's tomorrow's theme? Bermuda shirts. <laughs> I don't know how she comes up with this stuff. I think that's why you're the employee of the decade, Joyce. But it isn't all fun and games here, is it? We do get some work done. No, no, over here. Show you the processing. This is where we attract an individual's positive deeds and reward them with equally positive karma. You see, our employees can alter the environment to reward that individual. That's what they say. No, I don't think that's You know, true. let's get you back to reception. A little shortcut over here. Michael's gonna give you the tour of the negative side now. They don't have dress-up days like we have. It's a little dreary over there. All right, stand up through. Yeah.
one of the other people in the office. Huh. Must be that time of the month, you know? Crazy time. Yes. Oh. I'm Michael. I run negative karma. I'm not gonna spout off some cheesy comment like, no evil goes unpunished. Basically, we make bad shit happen. And if we happen to enjoy it a little, well, it's a perk of the job. Let me show you around. This is negative karma. Booyah! Another letter, Jessica. I think someone has a secret admirer. <laughs> Hank, never knew a woman and a horse could do that. Oh, Michael. Package. Why was they hit with the bus? I mean, that's a pretty heavy dose of negative karma. I don't know. Did you call your mother last week? No. Bingo. My mother's dead. And now you are too. <clears throat> Oops. You just knocked over all of my nail. accidentally knock me over with your foot. I hate them and their kind. You know, male boys. Okay, take a look at this jackass. The other jackass. I mean, obviously a blatant disregard for public bylaws. the worst time this could happen. I mean, everything's going good for me right now, okay? I just started a new lease on a smart car, and I have this date lined up with this super great girl. I mean, I got a promotion at work. This is a really big opportunity for me. Oh, mail boy. Senior mail boy, thank you. Let's meet the rest of the team, mail boy. This is Candy. <laughs> Yeah. Hi. This is Jessica. Hey, cutie. And this is Sandy. Hello there. What the hell is the deal with that? I know, she is quite a looker. I can get your number if you want. Seriously? She gets uglier by the day. I mean, when she first got here, she wasn't bad. Okay, why does everybody in this office look the same? Oh, yeah, yeah. All us crackers look the same. No, I mean, I, I mean, everyone in this office looks the same or, or similar or something. I don't know. I don't know. Hey, guys. Go away. Yeah, cool. See that? That right there. That's proof. That guy could practically be your brother. Oh, that's the evolution. What? You know what evolution is, right? Uh, yeah. Well, it's the opposite of that. Basically, the longer somebody's in this office, the more they de-evolve. I mean, hell, Harry has been here for I don't know how long. Okay, so why do we de-evolve? You sure ask a lot of questions. Who are you working for? You? Right. Anywho, 
Bet. You're looking awfully fat today. Now don't get any wise ideas, okay? Because there is no sex in the workplace. Yeah. Of course, no sex. I, I, I would never fish off the company docks. Well, don't get me wrong. I'm all about pleasure. I can get you some curtains, Michael. I mean, it's not physically possible. We don't have any genitalia. I don't get it. Oh, got me again! <laughs> Ten points for the pants! Booyah! <laughs> What's the point of no stuff? It was the Angels Union. They were complaining they didn't have any. Why should we? I just think they're a bunch of whiners, honestly. Well, then why does Hank serve porn all day? I mean, if he's got nowhere to, you know, go with it. We haven't quite figured that out yet. But you know, I do encourage it. Hank, you keep up the good work. Hey, get a load of this guy here. Oh yeah, old Benny's got something you need. I got some files for you to process. That's right. Benny, I can hear you. Poor Benny. Come on, I'll take you to your desk. Michelle's already there setting it up. Here's your dick. Now you're only gonna be in the middle of negative and positive karma just for a probationary period. No more than 30 years, it's a breeze. And look what I have for you. Bermuda shorts. For tomorrow. Bermuda shorts day. And guess what I have for you? Your files, get to work. Anywho, welcome to your new desk. Just think you're gonna be here for eternity. Did you see the look on Benny's face when I busted him checking me out? I think he was really embarrassed. I like Benny's hair. It's funny. Okay, Benny's a creep. He's like a stalker. I think he's very helpful. My bum. Yeah. Hey, Jessica. I see you're having a button malfunction. Oh, yeah. May I assist? Sure. <laughs> Maybe he can help you too. Yeah, I guess I could be a little nicer to him. Mm -hmm. Maybe I'll go help him with that file work he was talking about. <laughs> what the hell's going on? The computer is going crazy. It is dispersing karma with no lime or raisin. With what? With no lime or raisin. With no limes or raisins? Raisin. What? <gasps> Incorrectly. Oh. Look. Thanks for joining us here at the top stories we're currently following. A freak fire has re-orphaned several children. The Senate gives the nod to slavery law. And the right to vote for women gets revoked. Hmm. Huh. Women lose the right to vote? Well, I guess one out of three ain't bad. Yep. Yeah. Okay. <clears throat> Okay, attention everyone. Attention please. Hank, can you turn off your monitor? Benny, can you get help from under Candy's desk? Benny. Okay, word has come down from the top. And up from the bottom. That we're gonna do a 30 minute rollback. Apparently our systems have been infected by a file that was called Enlarge for Her Pleasure. <laughs> Mabel. What is a rollback? It's a system restore. It rolls back time to before the incident occurred. It hasn't been done in over a hundred years. It's highly irregular! Okay, everybody, take your positions. All right. You ready? Yeah, you ready? Yeah. 
You ready? Shut up.